Now, the Lagos State Police Command has called for cooperation and support from members of the public in the fight against crime. Commissioner of Police Abiodun Alabi made this appeal at the quarterly stakeholders forum on police accountability, an award organized by the Rule of Law and Accountability Advocacy Center, RULAC. Justin Akadoye tells us more. Over the years, there has been a disconnect and mistrust between the police and members of the public, stemming from lack of accountability to harassment, among others. However, the Lagos police boss, Abiodun Alabi, is here to speak on community engagement, a panacea for effective police performance. He encourages information sharing from the public, as it would build trust and confidence. There's a need for police partnership with members of the community for proper police and effective policing. It says that crime prevention cannot be holistic. Without input from members of the community, there's no way we can actually prevent crime without having input, without working in synergy with members of the community as critical stakeholders. The CEP identifies fear and reluctance on the part of the public as challenges. He is quick to advise residents to reach out to senior officers in their localities, assuring that their anonymity will be protected. We know all these things that uh, some people believe that up to today, if you give police information or intelli uh, gather intelligence and avail them this intelligence, there's a tendency for you to be sold out, for you to be for your identity to be revealed, and for the fear of uh, attack, you know, from the uh, criminals, people hold back their information and intelligence. But I want to assure you that you know that has become a thing of the past now. Any information or intelligence given to the police is treated with utmost confidentiality, particularly where you relate with senior officers. As the discourse moves towards effective policing, RULAC welcomes disciplinary measures taken against errant officers, but underscores the need to address the root causes of police misconduct and reward for outstanding and exemplary performance. The prompt and decisive disciplinary actions taken against these officers on the directives of the IGP is an indication of increased determination by the IGP to combat impunity for corrupt practices and unprofessional conduct in the NPF. I congratulate you all who are receiving this award. And please, when you get back to your workplace, whatever you have done to deserve this award, please use it in a multiplier effect to touch your colleagues. Poor pay and grossly inadequate working and living conditions are identified as causal factors for corruption and violence in the Nigeria police force. While government is tasked to ensure better funding, outstanding officers are rewarded for exemplary performances. Justin Akadoni. Plus TV News Lagos. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.